Welcome to A State of Sight. I'm Isaac Porter, and this is your update in ophthalmology and eye care, coming right here from Raleigh. And in this episode, I would like to explain clear lens extraction, otherwise known as refractive lens exchange, which is a similar procedure to cataract surgery, where we remove the lens from inside someone's eye and replace it with a clear artificial lens implant. In cataract surgery, the patient's lens is cloudy and needs to be removed in order to help them see better. But like you can tell by the name, with this procedure, the patient's lens is clear, it's not interfering with the vision, and they choose to undergo the procedure to correct either nearsightedness, farsightedness, astigmatism, or age-related focus dysfunction where they have trouble reading up close. Most of the patients that would choose this procedure would not otherwise qualify for a regular LASIK or PRK with the laser vision correction or other procedures where we put an additional lens inside the eye without taking out their natural lens. Because of the lens implants that are available now, we can correct most of the power that people need in glasses or contact lenses on the eye into the lens implant inside the eye. But because this is an invasive procedure inside the eye, the risks are higher than they are with laser vision correction with LASIK and PRK. Uh, because with this, anytime we remove the patient's natural lens, there can be a chance for an infection in the eye. Uh, there can be increased risk for retinal detachment. Uh, the patients could need more than one operation to get everything taken care of or they could have bleeding inside their eye. Also, because there's no cataract at the time of surgery, the medical insurance does not help cover the cost of the procedure. Therefore, a procedure that may cost, say, between four to $8,000 per eye would have to be completely paid by the patient. So you can tell that the costs of this are going to be much greater than that is now with standard laser vision correction. Uh, however, for some people, it's a very good procedure, especially people that are very nearsighted, uh, because although there are risks from the procedure, being very nearsighted can be extremely disabling. When we see patients that are minus 14, minus 16, they cannot see very much past a very close point to their eye. And so they may um, choose after they're informed to balance the risks of the procedure to the benefits that they stand to gain from the procedure. So this is um, more of a new procedure uh, here recently and if you have any questions about it uh, we'd be happy to uh, take your comments and interact with you to give you any information that you're looking for about clear lens extraction. So we hope to see you again soon next time on A State of Sight.